Good morning everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and I hope I don't sound too tired. If you had any idea of what my sleep schedule has been over the last couple days, or rather my lack of sleep schedule has been over the last couple days, then you might actually understand a little bit better. But it is very early in the morning, and I am going to get right into it, because I can't actually stop playing this game. We're down in Old Yarnum, we uh, pulled the lever to pull that sarcophagus, or the tomb back. So now we are actually down below what I believe was the regular Yarnum. And now, let's go ahead and proceed... Let's go ahead and proceed into Old Yarnum. This town is long abandoned. Hunters not wanted here. Alright, well, I am a hunter, but I am still going to come through. I hope that's alright. Also because I'm not really sure where else to go. Now, if this is an atmosphere, then I don't know what is. So we have all of these crosses with burning, now are these beasts or these, that looks like a beast right, the ears are all pointed. So it looks like the townsfolk are kind of just taking it upon themselves. Didn't you see the warning? I did? Why are you okay with your town belonging to beasts now, though? I mean, I could I could do some good for you. More blood vials, always, always welcome. What do we have below? Something's coming. All right, you're new. Let's see what you can do. A little bit of frame rate stutter. That's that's the first I've seen. That's a shame. All right. Looks like one straight ahead. I can see glowing eyes in the smoke. They're not so bad. Are you another one? You are. Oh, you wouldn't actually let me target you. That's sneaky. Very sneaky indeed. Man, this place is just absolutely foreboding. Alright. Something else coming. Some sort of shrouded creature. Alright, you actually seem pretty weak. Maybe not as weak as those other guys, but not too bad. Tempering Blood Gemstone. We'll see what those gemstones do next time we're uh, back in Hunter's Dream. Cold Blood Dew, level 2. And, oh, actually, was this something I can open? No? No. No, it's not. Alright. View Spectre. So these seem to be kind of buggy. If you click on them too early, sometimes they'll just disappear instead of actually letting you see what happened. But I did confirm that they are bloodstains, essentially. So you get to see how a player died, which can be really, really useful for pointing out ambushes. More bloodstone shards, good. Gets me a little bit closer. Oh, my coat's dirty. My coat's bloody, actually. Oh, something's coming. Alright, number of enemies down there. Cool looking clock tower type thing straight ahead. You are a skilled hunter. Thank you. Adept. Okay, a lot of enemies, so I'm gonna just oh wow, four hits didn't even kill him. But I'm going to take this area. Oh, slowly. Oh, okay. This guy hit me and caused some sort of bleeding. 
Not believe, but some sort of buildup. Blood vial. Okay. Is that it? Let's see if I can view this specter. Oh, you just kind of... Wow, you're just flailing around, huh? That didn't work out for you. Okay, item down there. Before we hop down, let's kind of survey a little bit. Which is why I must stop you. Whoa! Okay. So he wasn't kidding about the hunter being hunted. Yeah, that's a Gatling gun. So this is going to be me dodging behind cover for a while. All right, till I can, I'm guessing, get up to him and kill him. All right, there's a staircase. Let's drop down here since we know there's an item, and I should be safe behind this wall. Yeah, that looks good. Another bloodstone shard. You seem to have more health than the last ones. Can I... Nope. Come on. No? Alright, fine. Not gonna go for the backstab then. Antidotes. Okay. Oh, and more antidotes. So maybe... Maybe that buildup they were inflicting was actually a poison? That would make sense. Because as we know, these types of games... Oh, jeez. These types of games typically will give you items that you can use very, very soon, if not right away. And... Oh, jeez. Alright, this is the stairwell that I saw. Okay, so now we're connected. No need to do any backtracking or anything. Can he see me from here? Yeah, he's going to be able to see me from here. Well, let's get some of these attentions. And now I know that those pots actually explode. Uh-oh. I don't want to actually be in here, because I don't want to get shot. Alright, one down, and two. Really? You got the hit, huh? So I kind of want to just run through this. Oh, but there's an item. Whoa, Jiminy Crickets. More antidote. Some just went to the box. That's what that symbol means. Alright, definitely no dropping down here. Oh, crows. No, no, no. I, I timed that poorly. Alright. More shards. I do love me some shards. Alright, going... Going okay, I guess. Are you sleeping? Ooh, there was another sleeping one. And something else just happened. Alright, you just came out of somewhere. And you're dead. Alright, and let's go. That was rude. You have some reach, too. Oh. Nope. Definitely don't want to get grabbed by them. That's for sure. So you came through that room let's 
It sounded like something was coming, but maybe not. Blood tinge gemstone. Okay, yet another gemstone. No way of getting up that staircase. Alright, careful now. Another little courtyard. We know that there's some of these enemies patrolling. Ooh! That was close. What do you have here? Lure is effective. Lure, okay. Lure is effective. I have something to lure, don't I? I have the pebble. Pungent blood cocktail. I don't have many, but let's see. But where do I want to lure them? Well, that didn't, that didn't work. Let's... Where can I go that's safe? Maybe behind the tree? Whoa. Okay. I think I'm pretty safe behind this tree here. So this is where we'll do our fighting. Seems like things are slowly waking up as I kill them. Oh no, no, no. Not bad. Anything else in the smoke? No? Anything else beyond it? Can he see me this straight down? I don't know. I didn't kill you or you, so you are still alive. So are you. Alright, slow and steady wins the race, right? That's the name of the game here. And you can't get me here, which is good. I I was mistaken. No going in there. No items. Alright. Oh. Get behind here because he definitely just got a beat on me. But there's an item there that's going to put me in harm's way that I, of course, have to go for. That was a striking blood gemstone. Definitely starting to get a lot of these gemstones, which is great. But now... Cold Blood do and get behind the statue. And who is that? Running around... Like a madman. Oh jeez, are you coming all the way up here? Heck yeah, you are. Or did you stop? You changed your mind, didn't you? You did. Ow, 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 ow! I thought I was safe. Is there such a place as safe in this location? Oh man, you are quick. I don't really like the look of you. Oh, that was way too close. Alright, so there he is running over there. I don't know what that noise is. It looks like I can explore this way, and there's a ladder here. Maybe this ladder actually goes up to the guy with the gun? My coat is filthy. No idea where the Yarnum dry cleaning service is either. Okay, another ladder, and that definitely looks to be going up to where the guy with the gun is, or I can drop down. But the guy with the gun is easily the biggest threat. So hopefully, maybe he's just some decrepit guy in a wheelchair that we can just take out. But we'll get to the top and then scope it out before we just run in. Well, you're not in a wheelchair. In fact, you look uh, pretty terrifying. All right, let's give it a shot. Ooh. Okay. 
He is dangerous. There it is. How much damage am I taking off? Not a lot at all. You are like boss level, pal. And he's gonna knock me off, which is really what I should be trying to do to him. Yep, that's dead. I should think you still have dreams. Well, I'm gonna have a bad one tonight, well, thanks to you. The next time you dream, give some thought. Oh, and then you just follow after me. Nice. Ready for round two? Now our goal is just we're going to get up there, charge him, maybe we can push him off first. Because I don't have any bullets. So there's not a lot I can do. All right, <laughs> that worked. Worked like an absolute charm. And there he is, dead down there with an item. Can I use his gun? Remember the lost. You mean the guy I just killed? I remember him. I remember him being the jerk that killed me very easily. All right. Neat. Now, do I want to drop down? Or do I want to continue that way? Let's drop down. Let's drop down and see... Oh, jeez. Okay. You can also see I am using the whip, because right now the range is actually very, very helpful. Another place I can drop down to... Another one of those goobers down there. Now in a very, very large cathedral looking area, big chandelier, and a number of enemies on the ground. Okay. Very, very reminiscent to the cathedral that has the painting world in it. Alright, yep, I figured we're going to be traversing some beams in order to get items. With pleasure. There's another one down on that platform. Madman's Knowledge. Anything over there? Nothing over there. There's one item right there. There's also that walkway. How do I get to that one? Although I don't see any items there, but... Can I roll to that, or should I try jumping? Maybe I should try jumping. Oh wait, no, I can just drop right down here, I believe. <sighs> Careful. Molotovs. Really, really good. Some sort of altar down there. There's that item. But it looks like maybe there's an alternate way of getting there, because there is a doorway. Okay, skip that for now. Let's... Hopefully make this jump! No, we didn't jump. Doggone it. We didn't make it. That is a bummer. We'll have to come back up here now. That's a heck of a drop, huh? And there's actually a few enemies down there. What about now? Can I use the pungent blood cocktail? And not fall? Do you guys like that? You do! And... Wow, for 38 full damage. Be careful. I am clearly a very... Wow! I've made a horrible decision. Um, so what do you do when you are trapped by this many enemies? You run around, see if you can aggro more. This is going to be a test. All right. I don't know if you're going to go for it now. You know what? I need, I need Molotovs. I need Molotovs. Ooh. See if I can get them in a good group. Very effective. Although none are dead. But I'm not dead, so, you know, win-win. But I'm um, close. What a horrible room. Okay, definitely recommend coming in here to clear this area out first. That's going to be my official recommendation. You know what? It's whip time. I need the range. At least those other guys are slow. The 
these ones aren't, however. I can't... E I need to get some distance. Let's sprint. Okay. Almost one dead, so that's good. Two dead. And a blood vial. Good. I may, may need it after this. Ah! Really, really thought I was going to get that kill. Jiminy Crickets. Nope. Okay. I think all the fast guys are dead. And some of these guys have taken damage from the Molotov, I believe. Yeah, the Whip R2. Really, really good for groups. I mean, really good for groups. I cannot believe I just survived that encounter, I'll be honest. Who am I heart racing? Okay, what's on the altar? Ritual blood. Ritual blood. Okay, not in consumables. Material used in a holy chalice ritual. One of the basic ingredients used to satiate a holy chalice is this incoagulable blood. When all is melted in blood, all is reborn. So the chalice dungeons are a thing in this game that has kind of like randomly generated dungeons that you can explore. But you can also kind of create your own. Oh, where am I? And maybe that's actually part of that ritual. All right, looks like this might actually be the next area to go. But we want to backtrack to make sure we didn't miss anything. And I would actually like to go back up to get... Oh, there's an item there, too. Did I miss that? Oh, that's a different side. Looks like you might have to do that run at least twice to get all the items. Adept Blood Gemstone. Sounds good. Oh, is there another one? Unless you were just screaming, but it didn't seem like that was coming from you. Madman's knowledge. Oh, great. Is that my only way out? Maybe. Oh, no. Here we go. Where are you taking me? No mercy for the mob. <laughs> well, I did not have any mercy. All right, here we are. This is where the item is, and the one cloth guy. Man, I have been underestimating the whip in a bad way. Hugely, hugely useful. More bloodstone shards. That might actually get me. Where is upgrade material? Oh, it's right there. I have eight. I can now upgrade my cane. We're not going to go back just for that, but next time we're in Hunter's Dream... We might be in the money. Okay, that walkway right above our head is where we walked. So now we just have two of these guys to deal with. No big deal. Can I hit you? I can. That's just not even fair, is it? Well, I would say I feel bad. Just wouldn't be honest. More antidotes. Okay. I am so sorry, Whip, for not using you sooner. I truly, truly am sorry. Okay, so I'm on another walkway here. But it doesn't seem like I can get to any of the items I actually want to get to. Oh, wait, no. There was an item on this side, wasn't there? Yes, there is. Cold blood do. Eh, well. Echoes are echoes, right? A little bit of fall damage, nothing major. So let's now... Let's do it again. I know this is going to be kind of tedious, but I want to get that one item that I missed. You guys know me. I'm, I'm a completionist in these games. 
I make guides so other people can be completionists. Like, clearly I have a problem. I'm aware of this. So now, we know where the walkway above leads. Where does this lead? Hopefully, somewhere nearby. And it's very nearby. Okay. So let's go back up. I'm going to very carefully, hopefully make that jump. Oh, I have to deal with that guy, and I'm not looking forward to it. Now, the other thing that I wonder, and I, I'm pretty sure this is going to be the case, but will the crazy machine gunman come back if I die or if I rest? That I'm not sure about. I'm really, really hoping that he doesn't, but if he does, we'll deal with it. Alright, I can hop here. Remember, when you're traversing these things, just keep your camera pointed down. And I had it last time, I just didn't hit the jump button in time. There it is. This is something that I don't understand why they chose to make roll and jump the same button again. Dark Souls 2, that was one of the best mechanical improvements. The fact that you could remap jump to L3 instead of circle. Well, at least on uh, PlayStation controllers. And for them to take a step backwards truly feels like it's a step backwards. Bloody Messenger Head Bandage. Is it armor? It's not armor. What? Is it a consumable? I don't see how it would be a consumable. No? There it is. Accessory worn by messengers playing make-believe. Accessory adored by naive messengers imitating the bandages of scourge victims, unaware of their meaning. The spatters of blood give it a particularly nice touch. The inhabitants of the stump appear to have an interest in adornment. Why not let them be happy and revel as babes? So this is, uh, if you pre-ordered the game, or if you bought certain editions, you could get little things for these messengers to wear, like a fedora, top hat, and all that. I'm thinking what I just got is actually for them. So somehow I can customize my messenger so they wear a bloody rag, which that's kind of cool, kind of neat. Uh, now I have to drop down again and take damage. Um, will I take less if I roll? Nah, not so much. All right, as much as I don't want to, I think it's time that we go face our fears and take out that other guy. He looks like a rogue hunter as well. I have Molotovs, so I might actually just use Molotovs from range. Because he looks very, very fast. And I don't see a ledge that I can easily push him off of. We also, we need to go try to find the corpse of the gunman to see if I can actually reach that item that he dropped. I don't know if he fell over the open space or if he landed on that bridge. But we are about to find out. Okay, it's right here, and it's out of range. It is, he landed on the railing, and I can't get that. Unless I myself land on the railing, which I'm not willing to try. All right, there he is. Oh boy, let's see. Um, Do I want a whip? I think I want a cane. Okay, thank you for wasting that Molotov. Can we just have a fair fight considering I don't have a Molotov, or I don't have any rifles? 93 damage, that's it. Either you have some very high fire resistance, or you just have a lot of health. Oh, if you just want to keep running in that fire, I'm going to be honest, I have no problem with that. Alright, you're not so bad. You have a decent amount of health. Get up, please. Please get up. Ow! You're not so bad, he said. Yeah, keep running in the fire. Oh, gosh. I haven't hit him. I, I, I don't understand. I just swung a whole lot and didn't get a single hit. guy is brutal. Alright. I love what you're doing there, though. I mean, just... That's just wonderful. But if I stand here, are you just gonna keep doing that? No. But, hey. 
was worth a shot. There we go. There's some hits. He's about at half. I also have to watch, make sure he can't heal. Come on. Do you have explosive rounds? Alright, you're just stuck in a shooting loop and I don't like it. Did you just try to plunge attack me, sir? Oof. Good thing you have no poise. Can I finish? Oh, you are so... No! I knew it. I knew you were going to heal, too. You know what? R1 spam. This is how I PvP. Alright, he's going to go down, though. Come on. Nope, I don't want to keep trading blows. And I don't want to not get blows either. That's... Whew. Wow. What weapon are you using? Come on. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Alright, he's dead. That was a fair fight. Bone marrow ash. Have I picked that up before? That doesn't sound familiar. Additional medium that strengthens quicksilver bullets. According to the workshop, this is a special bone marrow ash collected from Hemwick Charnel Lane. Invaluable to hunters with weak blood tinge who require the use of stronger firearms. So this is what he was using in order to get those rounds that seem to be exploding. Alright, more monsters down there. Oh, where are they coming? Oh, those are just crows. I'm not worried about crows. I don't want to fight all of them at once. So maybe focus on the crows for now. Nothing coming up from behind. Ah, almost got me there, crow. Alright, looks like a place to jump down. We're going to skip that. Head down here. See if we can get some attention and then roll. There's another one. Just one more. Come on. What are you doing there, pal? Wow. Wow. He really just baited me into an attack. That was smart. Give him credit for that. How do I get in there? Guess we'll find out. What cold blood do? Ugh, that item is going to taunt me. I don't know what he drops now probably drops, like, the item you need to beat the game. Um, do I have to jump? Do I want to jump? How about roll? Rolling is sufficient. It looks like I can jump to that. Except I can't. And then, oh, did I want to be on that ledge? Or did I want to be here? No, well, maybe I wanted to be here. Alright, drop down again. A few notes. <laughs> Don't give up. I won't. You know what? Here. Enjoy your rating. That's a fine note. Alright, I have a treasure chest. But I also have a dark room. With one enemy there. One pretending to sleep. And some up on that balcony. Are they coming down? Can't tell if they're coming down or not. They are. Alright. Since those guys aren't aware, let's deal with these ones. Wow, okay. There's kind of a few of them. Back up. Back up. Oh, and these are all aggroed now. Oh, man, I have another horrible situation. 
Um. Hmm. Nope. Don't want to be. Don't want to be in the middle. Don't want to be in a corner. Can't see. Alright. I'm going to drag him out here. It's not a lot of room, but I can bottleneck him. And. Oh, come on. That worked beautifully. Worth a Molotov. Slash two to get the aim right. Oh, that was slick. Alright, whip time. Keep an eye on everything else. It looks like everyone's actually going back to their their chained area where they were when I first came in. So that's good. And I definitely thinned the herd a little bit with that Molotov. Oh, you got me, you dingus. Running out of blood vials. Here we go. Surprise! Oh, you're almost dead, too. What does a jumping attack look like with the whip? Ooh, pretty cool, actually. Yeah, I like that. All right, we'll come up these stairs to explore, but we have a treasure chest and some drops. Let's go for the drops first. Another gemstone. Blood vials, thank God. Oh, even more. Wonderful. Game is pretty generous with blood vials. I could use some bullets, though. And another gemstone. So, what you put in the chest, I just got off a drop of a common enemy. So, maybe rethink that decision someday. Here, an enemy. Okay, this is the window that we were looking into, and here's the item we saw. Charred Hunter Guard, more armor. Well, let's get into the light. Wow, I am nasty. 